Hi, I'm Mark Fosch, and today we're going to make an apple and frangipan tart. And so the first thing we need to do is to make the pastry. So we're going to use the kneading hook from the multi-quick five. So in goes the flour, butter. We're just going to add a tiny bit of salt to that. So we need to bring this together until it resembles sort of fine breadcrumbs. Okay, so once we've got those fine breadcrumbs, icing sugar, egg yolks, and we can just work the dough together. So that comes together very quickly, and we have the perfect sweet pastry. So we just bring that together to form a nice ball of pastry, and that needs to go in the fridge covered for about half an hour to rest. Okay, so the next step we have to do is the frangipan. So we need to slowly bring milk to the boil, and we're gonna flavor this milk with a nice vanilla pod. Okay, so for the frangipan, we need six egg yolks, cast the sugar, we're gonna bring that together. And we can pour over the hot milk. Okay, we're gonna add to that flour and ground almonds. Just mix that into the eggs. Okay, once we've got that mixed in, we can add it back to the saucepan. Back over the heat. And we just cook it out until it thickens. Okay, so I've just rolled out the pastry and lined the pastry ring with our pastry. We are ready to add the frangipan. So the frangipan is thickened up nicely. So we can just spread it evenly with the spatula. So once we have a nice coating, we can push our apples into the frangipan. We're going to sprinkle with a few whole almonds. And we're ready to bake this in the oven for about 25 to 30 minutes at 180 degrees. Okay, so after 30 minutes in the oven, we have our apple and frangipan tart.